Bonjour, I'm Chef Julien and today I'm going to demonstrate how to cook our Olala Beef Wellington. So our Beef Wellington come in a box with an instruction behind. Well, it's already is ready to be baked. So what you just have to take it out of the box. There is a plastic bag, so of course you need to remove that plastic bag and place and place your Wellington on a baking tray. Just normal baking tray. Then you can let it talk for about 30 minutes to one hour. So during the time that I'm towing my big Wellington, I'm going to preheat my oven at 220 degrees. So now that we have towed our Bay Wellington for about an hour at room temperature, it's time to bake it. So to bake it, it's straightforward in the oven, 220 degrees for 30 minutes. So what is important at this moment is just to place the Bay Wellington really in the center of your oven. You don't want to place it too high, it may burn, or too low also. So right in the middle of your oven. So now that we have processed our big Wellington for 30 minutes at 220 degrees, what we need is to change the temperature to 180 degrees and then we're going to cook it for another 10 minutes. Our big Wellington is made with a special dough. This dough is called the upgrade dough. An upgrade dough the advantage to be a dough made with a flour with reduced gluten. So much more less gluten, so it makes it much more light to eat. So now that we have processed our two temperature of cooking, we can remove our Wellington from the oven. Here we are, we have our beautiful big Wellington. What we need to do now is to let it rest for a good 10 to 15 minutes before you can cut it and enjoy it. And now I'm going to show you how to cut the beef Wellington without breaking all the crust. So the important part is to use a bread knife. That's the first, that's the first important thing. The second important aspect is to use all the knife while we are cutting and not to do small movement. We need to do long movement to really cut progressively our Wellington. So we go on a dough. We don't want to press too much when we are cutting. And we use all our knife from here to here. So you need to take your knife and then you cut using all your knife and without putting too much pressure on it. You remove the first slice. Then again, you use your whole knife and the last one. And here you have so your beautiful slice of beef Wellington.